Hey, hey guys, what's up? It's your friend Keith. Happy New Year. It's 2021 and I wanted to do the first video of the year by showing you our old recording studio where it all began. This is a little place called Moden Hall in Essex. It's a Victorian mansion. It was built in 1896 and this was our home when we first started out. This is the control room. You can look at the early videos on the channel. You'll remember seeing a there's a Rain Dirk desk here, then an SSL E-series console, then an SSL Duality Delta right there. We had all of our outboard gear over here. We had a couch right here, uh, more amps and stuff over here. And then this was our live room. Another giant reception room in this killer Victorian house. And the drum kit would be here. We had all of our bass amps and cabinets there. All of our guitar cabs lined up against this wall here. Man, so many memories. We did uh, Piston. They went national here in the UK. And uh, I would say made their big breakthrough here in this room. Youth Illusion, Liv Lawrence, 19 year old country singer, started out here. This was her first studio experience. Jay Busy, featured on Grime Daily, and now well on his way to seven figure streams. He started out in this room. Um, man, so many memories here. We had our uh, the highest view video on our channel is, is me with the Spectrumax and James, James doing a little demo of it. That happened right here. That's got like 160,000 views. That was right here in this room, guys. Now we've taken over a giant radio station compound in Southend-on-Sea, but uh, it was all of our hard work in this room. And this room, that made it all happen. Going over here, studio kitchen. A lot of the early videos were done on a table here in the studio's kitchen, right there. And then this was our guitar storage room, A. Our first guitar storage room was in here. This thing was packed to the ceiling. Hallway was packed, you couldn't move. And then this was the next guitar storage room. All the Fenders and Gibsons were in here. So all the Gibsons were lined up against there. You can still see some of the marks from the cases. All of the Fenders and acoustics were all here and here. Again, absolutely ram-packed. We had a lot of outboard gear stored up there. A lot of bands have used that bathroom. Woo! And then up here, which nobody really ever got to see, was where we stayed and where the bands would stay. So we'd come up here. And this was the main band guest room. In here, this is my room. It's nighttime now, but man, the views, the views out of these windows, rolling hills. We're just 40 minutes outside of Essex, or London, excuse me. But over there, we're surrounded by 600 acres of farmland and just big rolling hills. All around, every side for as long as we can see. There was a gym in here. Old Victorian toilet. This was the hangout room, the green room, living room. Many people slept on the couches in here. Fireplace there. A 
another guest bedroom where again many bands have slept and then the old shower it's a well, dis disco light in here today it seems anyway you get the idea guys go ahead and turn that off and that's it this was the earliest Essex Recording Studios. Technically, when we formed Essex Recording Studios, we were in another purpose-built studio that we were supposed to get a lease for, and every month, the landlord would be like, oh, yeah, 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 we'll get that lease right over to you. We'll get it right over to you. And it was a derelict studio that was awesome build, but totally gross because it had been left just derelict for years. These people were using it as an extension of their living room. Uh, we cleaned it all up. And then at the end, like, okay, guys, the lease, can we get it, please? We want to move in all this expensive stuff. We want to secure it. We need to know it's ours. And they said, yeah, thanks for cleaning it up. You guys did a bang up job. I think we'll just go ahead and keep it for ourselves now that you uh, did all that work. So, whoa. That was the earliest few months of Essex Recording Studios. Then we went to my old house, the tree house, where uh, Piston actually got started in, and uh, it just didn't cut the mustard. Then we found this place, and the rooms were big. The floors, I mean, these wood floors in this room made the drums sound massive. So when you hear Piston from a couple of years back, on their tracks that got national radio play. Those drums were in this room. We got a good video of that. It sounded great, it sounded epic. But I thought it would be a cool New Year's 2021 video to show you guys where we really started. This is the Essex Recording Studios origin story right here. And as we go out, it's pretty late. But you will see, we had a pretty killer car collection out here too. I mean, we're moving now, but Bentley Continental GT, Range Rover Sport SVR, Bentley 8, Rolls Royce over there. Um, my Ferrari was usually parked right here. So, really cool spot. Sorry I couldn't do the video during the day, but at least... You've got to see the behind the scenes of Moden Hall, which was Essex Recording Studios 1.0. Now we're in the Global Radio and Daily Mail, former headquarters building, massive radio station complex. We've got a huge, huge four stage rock venue we're opening up next. Uh, really exciting. That's where we're moving to now. So stay tuned, guys. It's getting bigger and better, and it's all because of you. If you guys weren't watching, if you weren't supporting us, we wouldn't be doing this. So really appreciate it, guys. Enjoy the new year. Let's, uh, man, say goodbye to 2020. That year is a write-off. And uh, let's make some more memories together. Thanks, guys. If you're new, if you're watching this, welcome. Welcome to our family, our circle of friends here on the internet. Follow us on all the socials at Essex Recording Studios, YouTube's Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, all that stuff. And uh, we got EssexRecordingStudios.com. And yeah, that's it. Can't wait to talk to you guys in the new year. It is the new year, at least over here in the UK. America's a few hours behind. I'll see you all soon. We've got some super cool videos coming up. Uh, the channel is going to be totally different this year. We, we've got some pro directors coming in. Insane lighting, insane cameras. Uh, you're going to love it, guys. Cool. It's late. i got to go drink some bubbly now. Get home. I'll catch you all later.